วันนี้วันที่อุ้ย26เดือนเดือนอะไรก็ไม่รู้เมนะ yes today is the 26th of of March I am back in Lee While I was away, P. Greg was very busy with cutting down the mamuangs, so it looks very, <laughs> very different. I'm very surprised that this tree is still alive because we were cutting it down quite a lot, and then we opened this one up, but it's still alive. I was living in Chiang Mai for one month now and now I'm really happy to be back. <laughs> Having a garden, much better air quality. It's just, countryside is just different. Okay, and this is what P. Greg was doing. He started yesterday with Kun Po and Pinop and they already did quite a lot. Yeah, it's like a huge graveyard For those bugs, I hope it's gonna be a graveyard. <laughs> yeah, it's really sad that we're doing this now because we tried so many things. To get rid of the worms than the other bugs and now we have this huge problem with those grasshoppers and it's yeah it's just sad if you put a lot of effort on something and it's just it's not gonna work wow you pass a tree and then you just hear <laughs> it's crazy You cannot even walk without a shirt through the garden anymore. This is just horrific. <laughs> Still having some beautiful Malagos. Mimi, kitu ng Fabian de Pau. Kitu ng Fabian de Pau. Nenon, jamai. Let's see what's going on with the banana garden. At least there are no bugs jumping around. Yes, P. Greg was very busy. All those branches and leaves from the Don uh, Mamuang, from the oui, mango trees. And Pinop and Kun Pa, they are coming with the car, taking the branches and all the leaves and bringing them up to the mountain because it's just too much and so you can kind of like Getting rid of them. Kuai suk leo. Gonna take those out so we don't have the birds and all the ants here. And the rest will go into the cage. Pondamai. They are already gone. Makam. The sour type. Very nice if you don't have limes. The tree is like this. You're gonna use a bamboo stick and support it to push the banana tree up again, like this. Lots of jackfruit again, but nobody gonna eat them because it's just way too much. <laughs> Chilies have a lot of flowers, very nice, because I love to eat spicy food. And we're having some very nice mulberries. 